day one here at TTC was a good one. The sections were tough and it was hot enough to be very physically demanding. I was struggling even after the first loop and it was a long first loop. There were a lot of riders here today, so that was great to see, but it did slow me down on the first loop and throughout the day, so had to work for it quite a bit. There were some really tricky sections. Only had really one mistake, a single dab that I felt like I didn't need, just kind of rushed something, but everything else I kind of kind of needed those ones and had some good saves here and there and some good rides as well. Section 12 was the, the deal breaker, make or break, huge undercut splatter, only made it once. I tried my best the second and third loops and gave it everything I had, but it wasn't enough. So a little bum to end it on a five after a day like today, but hopefully I can recover and have a solid day tomorrow. Uh, Saturday went about as good as I really could have asked for. Uh, started off pretty solid and then just got through my first loop, tried to minimize the, the big mistakes and uh, actually started lowering my score throughout the loops, which is uh, a, a good goal to have to get better as the day goes on. Uh, it's super hot and humid here in Tennessee, and so uh, trying to stay hydrated and stay cool throughout the day was uh, actually a pretty big challenge. Um, super happy that I uh, got through with very minimal cramps at all, so big shout out to Hammer Nutrition for that one. But uh, no, I gotta be happy. Uh, the Scorpa, 300 today went absolutely flawless. The bike was absolutely singing. Uh, I just wish my riding could have been a little bit better. I'm not too far off of third place today, so uh, to know that I'm within touch of those full-time riders uh, is, is a good feeling. Um, the, only, the only downside is I wish I just could have made it through section 12. Real big hit. and uh, Yeah, overall pretty good. So Saturday started off uh, pretty rough for me. Uh, timed out of the first section and then knocked the marker off the second section and then from there I just kind of rode like I was at home you know I just, just decided to just kind of live stress-free and ride the best I know I could and you know my first loop really wasn't that great I had a 20 28 point first lap I wasn't really happy with that and then coming into the second loop it was almost a carbon copy of the first unfortunately uh, the only difference was that I made it up um, the big step in section 12, so I was really happy about that. Um, I think that is by far the biggest rock I've ever hit from flat uh, with an undercut, so I was really happy to get up that. Um, so yeah, I had a 23 point second lap, which uh, needed some improvement, and then coming into the third loop, I, um, I really cleaned things up, you know, a 12 point last loop. Uh, again, I got up the step in 12 again, so I'm really happy with that. And I'm, Really happy with how the bike worked all day today, especially in this heat. It's it's not easy on us out there, I tell you what. Um, lots of heat and fatigue and sweat everywhere. And uh, yeah, we worked through it and happy to come out with a fifth place. Uh, I knew I wasn't quite on pace to beat my brother today, but you know, we're gonna try harder on Sunday. The sections on Sunday were a bit easier, but still plenty tough for me. There were quite a few tricky spots. Section 1 was not one of those spots, but I managed to mess up the first rock of the day. I kind of went for half a zap and half a splatter, made it about halfway up. Luckily I was able to save that with a 1. Then section 2, they were setting up really close to the tape and I didn't want to risk a 5, so I took a harder line and ended up taking a point there as well. From there, I was able to clean up everything besides number 5 or 6 on the second loop, so pretty happy with my riding overall throughout the whole weekend. And got to give it up to the team for providing a great bike to ride over the weekend and putting so much effort into it. Thanks to Luke as well, he did a great job minding and it was great to have my family out to support me. Yeah, Sunday was a lot better start than Saturday for me. Um, had a couple dumb mistakes here and there, just single dabs, a uh, couple threes on my first lap, uh, but a 15 point first lap wasn't bad for me. I knew I had plenty of spots to clean up and that's what I went out to do in my second loop and came back with an eight point loop and I thought that was really good and I knew I needed to crank up the wick uh, for the third lap. So coming into the third lap I had a three point loop going until I tore a marker off uh, on section six. Uh, I wasn't too happy about that because that was my first and only five of the day. Um, but regardless, I came out with a fourth place and the bike ran great all weekend and uh, had plenty of, plenty of hammer products to keep me fueled in the hot weather. You know, it's, it's not easy on bikes and bodies out here when it's 85 degrees and 85% humidity. So um, thanks to all the sponsors that kept us going this weekend. And yeah, I'm happy with um, all, of our, all of our bikes performances and my riding as well. So yeah, looking forward to California. Uh, man, I had really high hopes for how I rode this today. Uh, I started out really, really well on the first couple sections. Uh, 
actually after the first couple, I think I was beating Pat, which made me feel really good. And then Pat started doing Pat things and I started doing me things. Um, made a couple really dumb errors on the first loop. Uh, really covered up the good riding I was doing. I was riding really well on the bike and the bike was working really great. But I just had a couple of really costly uh, fatal mistakes to my day. Um, you know, I had more fives than the guys in front of me and that's ultimately what caught me out. There was just one section I couldn't quite figure out and uh, that, that's what did me in. Uh, other, other than that, my third loop I'd only had two points. So um, I'm pretty happy with how I'm riding. I just need to figure out um, challenging, tackling every section can be challenging and so um, being ready for any circumstance is uh, part of what it means to be a pro. So. I just got to work on that more, but overall today, Sunday, I'm uh, pretty disappointed.